Easter, Jesus rose today. If you're a Christian, then you know what I mean. I'm off. I'm actually still at work. The reason why I'm here is because I'm going to get my nails done and the place is literally like five minutes from, from work. So I'm just gonna wait till they open, get my nails get my nails done and then we're going to well hit the streets later on today i'm going out later on today so i thought i'll just vlog so i'm gonna take you guys to the shops to get my nails done with me and then i'm gonna go home tidy up i got some stuff from plt that arrived yesterday i think i'm gonna wear one of the dresses i bought from that because i can't really seem to think of what i feel like wearing today's a little bit of a nonsense weather day i mean yeah that is what we're working with it's raining so horrible we're gonna make make it work i mean i can't make the weather work but i'll make the day work somehow so what i'm gonna do today plans for today plans for today today i plan obviously get my nails done i'll take you guys along to the nail shop my appointment is at 10 o'clock right now it's eight o'clock so what i'm doing is i've just made my lunch because i had some sausages and stuff i'm gonna make my lunch i might not eat it because i'm not really feeling hungry right now but i made it anyway and i'm watching let's see i'm watching harlem while I wait, I might just have a little lie down before I go and get my nails done. If you guys are wondering, I did a night shift, so that's what I'm doing. I've actually finished work, I'm off the clock. My face is a bit rounder, guys, because I have now gone and gained some more weight because I've been eating badly. I've been eating so, so, so bad. I'm gonna get back on from not this week, week after. I'll take you guys along to what I'm doing later on today i'm vlogging with my phone because i don't have my camera with me because i didn't think i was gonna vlog today I thought, oh why not let's let's vlog another day where i'm not really doing where i'm doing something fun i'm going to dlt brunch i'm gonna get my nails done go home try on my stuff do a little bit of a tidy up maybe relax and then get ready because i'm gonna do some reels today not reels some i'm gonna do like some tiktoks because i really enjoy tiktoks i leave my tiktok thing here for you guys if you're not following me you should follow me my content is not great just yet because i'm still kind of learning the ropes of tiktok but i've posted a few videos so i might do some tiktoks today i might do a little get ready with me on tiktok today as well so follow me on there if you're not <laughs> why it's it's a bit bright on this side i've got my nails done that's what they look like i kind of wish i got a base coat now the nail tech guy actually told me asked me if i wanted a base coat i said no <laughs> i don't know what i was thinking or what i thought it would look like but i kind of wish i had a base coat now i wish i did I wish I did, but it still looks nice. I just, you know, you could just see all of that. But anyway, that's, it's it's done. It's done now. It is what it is. At least I feel like myself. I feel like myself again. So right now I'm just watching. I'm trying, about to watch Netflix. I'm about to watch that. A simple lie. Um, So I'm just going to be at home. I'm just going to chill for a little bit. I don't have to be out until five o'clock. So I've got like four and a half hours to get ready, do my rows and be out. So that's a lot of time. I have, so I don't really need to do my wigs or anything. I'm just going to wear the wigs that's already prepped and ready to go. I don't have time for that. Um, and look at my dressing gown set that I got. Let me show you guys. I got it from Primark. Let me show you guys full length. So I got the dressing gown from Primark. 
it's a short shorts a vest top and the dressing gown coat which is really cute i've got it because i love the print the print is absolutely fabulous so now it comes with a belt as well it's really nice and the price, it wasn't actually too badly priced i think the top and the bottom were seven pounds each and the coat the dressing gown was 18 pounds or 17 pounds they're about it's quite nice it's not all the way to the floor i like like a floor length dressing gown but this is quite nice just to chill out at home and um yeah i actually bought bought it to wear out and about like on holiday and stuff but the dressing gown part is not long enough and i like a very long dressing gown but that's all good so i'm just gonna chill at home i didn't get my tail nails done because the wait was too long in the shop and i honestly i was so fidgety in that nail shop i could not wait to get the heck out of there i literally i couldn't wait so i was just like no i'll just i'm gonna wear boots anyway so no one's gonna see my toes today i'll show you guys my outfit later on i haven't fully planned what i'm gonna wear but i kind of have an idea i have like a slight idea what i'm gonna wear today i also got these from plt i'm gonna sure try it i'll do like a mini haul show you guys what i got from plt the dress in here was the dress i was talking about earlier on that i bought so i might wear but if that doesn't work i have plan b kind of let me kind of show you guys what i got let's try it on let's do a, a mini try on <laughs> So this is the dress oh my god guys do not watch i have this thing on my head but oh and i'm not even a halter neck babe but this looks so good that looks so nice i love the frills i feel like i have to wear heels with this just because that frill is so low like look at that that frill is literally hitting the ground let me show you guys it's so the frill is so long That frill is literally, she's hitting the floor. We're happy. What y'all think? She cute. She cute. I might just do like a little tape on the boob just so my boobs can can do what boobs need to do. I wouldn't mind like a little snatch on the waist, but oh my God, she is cute. So this is my outfit today. This is my outfit today. I'm just going to put some boots on. Maybe these. Maybe these boots. Would these boots work? Let's see. Would they work? Anyway, you guys will see the full outfit at the end. At the end of today. So right now, I'm just trying out what's going to work. No. No. I don't think these boots are doing it for me. No. They could work, but... No, I don't think these boots are the way. These, these are not the boots for this look. But oh, I'm so I love this so much. This is from PLT. Oh my god. PLT did that. They came through with the came through. They came through with the come through. And I don't like halter necks. So I don't like halter necks because of my arms. But I don't think this one's bad because it's got the frills. Um yeah. I have to find the perfect shoes to wear these now. But this is this is gonna be my outfit for today. I'm on a little bit. Yeah, I'm no DC. Mm -hmm. This top. It's just like a simple this top of a print. And I like this lip print there. And I think this would look so nice with some of my outfits. I got something from Jaded. I wish it came. I would have worn that. But I have another party that I'm going to wear the Jaded set to. I'll show you guys in another video. I'm going to do like a Jaded haul as well. So you guys will see. This is cute. I like the little biting lip print on the side. I think that's really cool. It's giving very Y2K vibes. I'll try that on a sec. And then I also got this skirt. I previously got this skirt in a size 10. But it's too, I should have my AirPods so you guys can hear me. But it's too small. It was too small, so I got it in a size 12. So let's see what they look like. This is the top. This is what the top looks like. It's a pretty top. It's very basic, like there's nothing special about it. But that's kind of it, really. I just wanted a nice white crop top and it kind of does what it says on the tin. Nothing really special. I kind of wish I got it in a size down. But to be fair, it was only this size up. I think this is a size... 12 no that's not 12 it's a size what am i doing 
It's a size 14, and that's because I couldn't find a size down. I couldn't find a smaller size, so I had to get this. But it's still quite nice, still does the job quite well. And this is the skirt. I've got hip pads on. I know that might be a little bit controversial, but listen, sometimes you need to give yourself extra hips in an outfit, and I think this skirt is one of those. And I've got hip pads on, so yeah, that's what that looks like. That's really pretty. Do you know what I think? That's really nice. I like it and I've got a perfect top to go with it. I don't know where the top is right now. It's somewhere. Okay, I've got this top from PLT that I think will work with. And let me try that on and see. This sure. is what the top looks like. Mm, I think it's too much. I feel like it's just too much frills. <laughs> Personally, it's like frill galore. It's nice, but I just feel like it's just too much frills. I feel like it's too much frills. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think I could wear them together? As I said, would it look too much? It kind of does look a bit too much. I'm not going to lie. I think these frills here are a bit too much. See, if I cut the frills off and just had it as a skirt, like a matching skirt with just this frills on the front, I think that could work. I could cut these frills off and add them somewhere else on the skirt or something. Let's see if the frills were not there. Let's try it out. Okay, this is me trying to recreate the frills not being there. <laughs> Does that work? If the frills were in there, so maybe just frills on the sides or no frills on the front. Could that work? Is that a look? I think it's a look. I don't know. I don't know. Frills, no frills, what do y'all think? Are the frills too much? Is it too frivolous? I think it looks nice. If I have like my hair on and stuff, I think it looks nice. But at the same time, I also feel like it's a lot of frills. Especially the ones in the front. And then there's none at the back. What do you guys think? Anyways, these are the clothes that I got from PLT. I'm just gonna put back my things on and relax and eat some food at bowl. I might go and warm up my lunch from yesterday and have that for dinner and have that now. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to looking strange because i don't have any lipstick on or anything it just looks a bit weird i do not i don't like the lashes i have on i don't like my lashes at all but i have to manage it because that's what i have so this is my outfit the waistband is kind of doing some weird things that i don't i don't understand it's looking a bit strange but that's my jeans where my things on the bed my mirror is broken over there i don't know if you can see so i can't show you with that mirror this is how I can show you my outfit. I haven't put my lipstick on yet. I'm going to do that in the car. I was going to wear a chunky earring, but I, I changed my mind. So I'm just going to wear this. I think this looks perfect. What y'all think? Nice? No? Okay. So let's go to the party. <laughs>
getting to my train station now. It's been such an eventful day. How did I start this day off in my car <laughs> and I end up on the train? Crazy. So now I'm just getting off the train. I'm going to get my Uber. I should be home in like 10 minutes. Yeah. What an eventful day. I feel a little bit sick though. If I had some vodka, I actually wanted Red Bull. But I had vodka and lemonade. And oh my god, I tell you, that vodka tastes like crap. Absolute crap. I wanted to stop about to get some food. So I am starving. So um, I don't know if the cab driver is going to be able to wait for me. Cab for Annie. What a day it's been. <sighs> Can't believe I started off my day like this. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna sort my stuff. <sighs> I'm gonna find my V5, tax my car, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it. <sighs> I'm just a bit conflicted, uh, honestly. I don't know if I should go back tonight to get the car towed or should I wait till the morning? So I'm just, I don't know. I'm a bit conflicted, I don't know what to do. But anyway, I'll tell you this full story of what happened <laughs> to me today. I'll tell you the full story when I get home because it's been crazy. <laughs> it's been crazy. Honestly, it's been absolutely mad. Hey guys, so let me tell you the story of my day today. <laughs> I didn't really vlog what really happened because in the moment I just needed to sort myself out and then I would be able to tell the story after. I didn't want to tell the story in the middle of the in situation. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to start off with what happened in the house, from the house. So from the house, um, my mirror broke. So I was telling you guys, my mirror broke. This mirror broke. So I went downstairs to sort out some stuff. I can't remember what I was sorting out. Sorting out some stuff downstairs. No, I had... Okay. So I had a flat tyre. My tyre has like a slow puncture or something. So it slowly decreases. So it slowly decreases in air pressure. So my tyre pressure was low. Right? I thought, okay, cool. So I went downstairs to actually sort that out and get myself something to drink. So while I was downstairs, I didn't realise that this mirror must have fallen after I left. So I've come back upstairs to get something. And this mirror is on the floor, like shattered. Like all the glass, broken glass on the floor. And I'm like, okay, it looks like it's going to be one of those days where things just decide to go wrong while I got things to do. <laughs> okay. So, okay, I thought, okay, you know what? It's, I'm not phased. I'm not gonna lie, I was going to buy a new mirror anyway. I wanted to buy a new mirror because I went to IKEA two days ago and I saw a mirror that I wanted to get. So I was gonna replace the mirror anyway. So I didn't feel too bad because I'm like, okay, you know what? We were gonna replace her anyway. But I didn't want her to break. I did not want her to break because <laughs> I was gonna use her somewhere else. But anyway, she broke. I don't know if you guys can see. Like that's like really she's she, like it's it's done out here. Like done if you guys can see if it focuses it is done so that broke so i came up now i'm running really late i think it was like about four o'clock and i have to be there by six so i my god i need to clean up this mess i need to go go to sh have a shower get myself ready to go to this event so i come upstairs i clear up the mess i hoover i do all the things i need to do really quickly and then i go have a shower i come back i'm literally scrambling around hence the reason why i couldn't really vlog properly i couldn't really talk because i was trying to hurry up to get myself ready so i've done that gotten ready got in the car like i said my tire i don't know i think this story is all over the place the tire of my car was low so i went i pumped my tire when i went to pump the tire it was when the mirror fell and broke i didn't realize until i came back upstairs and i was warming up something to eat as well so i had to rush my food clean up the mess with the mirror, finish pumping the tire of my car 
and then have a shower and get myself ready so i like I was getting myself ready i was literally rushing to get ready because the last entry for the event we're going to is at six o'clock and at that point it was like half four when i started getting ready so i'm like okay you know what i think i'm gonna be late but they probably will let me in because this place is sometimes they say last entry is six o'clock they still let people in up until about seven ish so like you know what i'll be there by seven finish jumped in the car went it was gonna take me about 50 ish minutes to get there so i'm like halfway through the journey in hammersmith on hammersmith flyover those of you guys who know hammersmith the hammersmith flyover it's a double red line you cannot stop there and i was on the bridge i was literally on the flyover you can't stop there so i'm listening to my music and everything and the song literally transitions into another song but i hear like an extra sound and it sounded like a and i'm like hold on this is not a dj mix under no circumstance should that kind of sound be happening on my tune so i take the song back to hear it again to see if it was from the music or it was something to do with my surroundings so i play it again and i didn't hear the sound so, I'm, so i keep driving but i'm like okay i think it might be my car i think it might be my tires so i'm like driving really slowly driving really slowly now the car the steering wheel starts to do the 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 funny the funny thing i'm like oh my god my tire has popped my wheels have popped i'm on the hammers we fly over i'm like okay let me keep going i don't want to stop here because it's just going to be so hectic to stop at that point so i keep driving but now i'm slow i turn on my hazard lights and i'm driving so i get to like i kind of drive through and then get to the first turning on the left because i kind of know the area so i knew that there was a place i could turn so i thought i'll just keep going really slowly till i get to the left turn but i didn't know how bad the tire damage was i didn't know if it popped if it deflated it sounded like a deflation to me before i even checked the car i'm like you know i gotta call the aa because i don't want to miss this party because i have not been out in a long time so i'm like i was actually really looking forward to going out today because i was supposed to go out on saturday but i didn't end up going because i didn't have anyone to go with and i got tickets but the tickets were so crazy the ticket i kind of got the tickets last minute so i'm like you know what i'll just go out on monday instead i was really really looking forward to going out today so i'm i'm, I'm disappointed but at the same time I'm like you know what today is just one of those days <laughs> just one of those days where everything just wants to go left anyway i parked my car i called the aa they're asking me all these questions oh what's the speed limit on the road you're on are you on a safe road and the thing with the aa if you tell them you're on a safe road trust me no one's gonna come in the next few hours nobody's gonna come so i tell them no i'm on how must we fly over i'm on a double red line and y'all need to come so they tried to do this tracker thing to track my location so i literally come out of my car i run back to the main i literally ran back to the main road so that the thing could track me on the main road so the guy was like did you turn left i said no i didn't turn left i'm literally on the pad traffic like i'm literally parked obviously when the guy comes i was just gonna tell him oh i didn't want to wait there anymore so i drove the car that's what i was gonna say that like, i didn't want to so i drove the car because i wanted it to come really quickly so anyway <sighs> now the guy speaks to me and he's asking me other stuff and he's like hold on a second <laughs> your road tax is expired since the first of april and i'm like sorry what <laughs> he's like yeah we can't come and get you because your road tax is expired since the first of april and the only thing we can do is tow your car we can't actually repair it or take you anywhere else we can literally tow the car away but you're gonna have to pay for it yourself and i'm thinking wait so you mean to tell me that all this time i've been paying 25 pounds a month for aa breakdown and now that i actually need it all this time i've not needed it now that i actually need it i conveniently have also run out of road tax at the same time i'm thinking oh my god oh my literally at this point i'm like i i was still not upset because i'm like okay you know what keep positive you know we're gonna start this we can fix this so i'm literally <laughs> i'm literally like okay what do i do what do i do because my nigga ass is broke i'm broke at this point i'm broke because obviously it's my bill week and i've literally all my money's gone to other things so i'm like i can't afford right this second to have um someone i paid like it was like a hundred and something pounds 
to get the car towed and that's not to get the tire fixed that's not to do anything else that's the cheap and because obviously it's bank holiday monday all the shops i could get the tire fixed from are closed so i'm thinking okay, if i get the car towed i still have to buy new tires i still need to pay for the tow i don't have that kind of expense right this second like i have money saved but i can't touch it. it's money i can access so i'm like oh my god what i'm going to what i'm going to so i call my cousin obviously my cousin helps me out with some money but i'm like hold on i can't even do anything today anyway because all the tire shops are closed so all i would have had to do is get the car towed come home and literally just sit down and do nothing and i would have been so i would have been more upset being in this house that brings me to my plan so what i ended up doing i ended up leaving my car there ended up getting an uber to the venue thankfully i wasn't that far away i was like 20 minutes away so i got uber to the venue so what i'm now going to do i've got the v5 here i'm gonna tax the car tomorrow morning very early i'm gonna go there about six o'clock i'm gonna go there i'm gonna call the aa they're gonna come pick my car my car's gonna be taxed so i'm gonna gonna have to pay the call out charge my car's gonna be taxed i'm gonna do it tonight i'm gonna take it straight to where i'm gonna get new tires get new tires fixed and i'm gonna head to work what a day but you know in all of this i'm actually quite calm i'm i'm kind of i'm not stressed as i normally would be in situations like this i'm not stressed i'm actually quite calm which is good but the only other thing is i'm really hungry i'm really really hungry i've got some sausages down to so i might have that but anyway it's been an eventful evening it's been an eventful evening i couldn't i tried to enjoy myself as much as possible as i could i tried to make sure to have a good time while i was there but i got the nasty vodka thing that i was telling you guys about earlier and it was uh, and oh my god guys drinks ex listen this cost of living is really really costing me to live tell me why a shot of vodka and lemonade was 20 pounds it was 19 pounds something tell me why a shot of vodka and lemonade is 19 pounds 60 something pretty much 20 pounds at this point it doesn't make sense like why is maybe i skipped the part where i would things were i don't know but in the last one week i'm really seeing how things have gone up in price and i am i'm shocked god i'm shocked the price of everything is high i bought apple juice this afternoon tell me why the apple juice was £1.59 for a carton of apple juice because I don't drink um, juice I only bought the juice today because I wanted to mix I wanted to do like pre-drinks before I left home so I'm like okay you know what I'm just have some drinks here and while I'm out I don't have to drink so much I could just have like one uh, a, a one drink and I'll be good so I, I went and bought apple juice and oh my god the apple juice is so expensive oh my god so that's been my palava for today that was the palaver of the day. I really hope my V5, my car is here. Because if it's not, it's going to be peak. This vlog was meant to end this evening. But as it stands, it looks like I'm going to end the vlog in the morning. I'm showing you guys what happens with my car in the morning. And then, yeah. What a day. What a day. This earring here is really hurting my ears. But what a day it's been. <laughs>
done for the day. I'm tired. I'm just gonna head to sleep now. Oh, I'm so cold because I left my window open when I went out, so the room is so cold. Just waiting for for it to kind of warm up a little bit. I'm so cold. And I'm really tired and I have to be up in a few hours because I have to go and sort my car up before I head to work in the morning. So I'm going to go to sleep now and I will catch up with you guys on another vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this vlog was a little bit um, chaotic. Um, but yeah, sometimes these things happen. I don't know. I guess maybe life was life in so i can have something to show you guys it would have been nice if the vlog was fun throughout but hey ho just a little bit of fun in there i didn't really capture much content of me being out but i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and um i will see you guys in the next one have a good rest of the day night wherever you are good night good morning guys so <laughs> I couldn't even sleep last night so i woke up this morning very very early i woke up at five just so i could come and get my car like i was saying to you guys last night the situation with my car is still ongoing so i finally i did my road tax last night woke up so early this morning and i got on the train came to my car i didn't really want to vlog this but i thought why not let's conclude the situation with the car on this vlog and then <laughs> I could call it a day. I'm meant to be working this morning. I called my manager and I basically explained the situation with the car. And he said, that's fine. You could just work from home today. So I'm like, yes, hallelujah. I am so thrilled. So now I don't have to go into work. I can work from home today. Amen to that. So when I get my car sorted, I'm going to go back home, which is really good. Because then I could just work in a more relaxed environment. And now I'm walking to my car. I've already been to my car this morning. I needed to use the toilet, so I went to the Pret. My car's just off the road, so I'm just walking back to my car now. Oh, it's been a crazy morning. I called the AA to um, speak to them about the situation with the car. And they were like, oh, well, when you reported the situation with the car, the car wasn't taxed, so you still have to pay the call-out charge. So I still have to pay the £99 call-out fee and then get the tyre fixed. <sighs> you know what? It is what it is. It's just one of those things that happened with cars. But I haven't had car issues in a very long time. And I spoke to the rudest, 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 rudest person from the AA. And I was trying to explain to her. She's like, don't shout at me. I'm like, babes, I'm not shouting at you. I'm talking. But it's so irritating when you're trying to talk to someone and they just say your shout oh that lighting mm. lighting is lit but it's so annoying when you're trying to talk and then they just result in saying it's shouting it's so annoying because i'm like wait hold on because now i can't talk because when i'm talking it's shouting that's so rude but anyway i'm not gonna lie to you this walk is good it's making me want to consider walking more i should walk more i drive everywhere i should really walk i mean oh my god this lighting is so lovely it shows you my true eye color oh about two hours later it's now 9 30 9 20 something i am finally getting tired so guys <laughs> we are finally getting a move on praise jesus praise god no sorry man he's mine somebody's trying to poach my truck towing guy sorry boo he's mine we are getting a move on let me just text my manager to let him know that i'm finally getting somewhere with this mess called how long have you been waiting two hours two hours. i got here actually two hours 20 minutes okay so yep. i think i was here just before the new i was here at quarter past seven because my van broke down as well really and now i'm still what RAC. RAC is the worst. I know, I know. This is <laughs> it's the worst. I was with RAC. I waited one day for seven hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe seven hours. So trust me, switch. RAC is the no, worst. Unfortunately, this is my company that they yeah. use RAC. Oh. Maybe they have a good deal. Yeah. The price is cheaper, but we know why. The service is just terrible. I know, I know. It's terrible. I'm still waiting here. Yeah. Good, good luck. Yeah, thank you very much. Good luck <laughs> <laughs> She's really mashed up. Oh, God. 
Yeah, that is my girl. That's where we at right now. So right now my car's getting towed. And um, how many happy days? I need the toilet because I feel like whenever I'm nervous, I get very, um, like I need to use the toilet. And I don't even know why I'm nervous because this is getting sorted. I think, I'm, I don't know why I'm nervous, but I just feel, I feel too nervous right now. I'm feeling very, very nervous. <sighs> My baby's going. Like the heck, <laughs> and the funny part is the tie that I pumped yesterday is the other one, so this one just decided to do its own thing. You know what? It could be worse. I'm just glad I'm in a better situation, I can get it fixed and get it sorted. Anyway, see you guys at the garage or when I get home or when this is sorted out. I'll, I'll see how it goes. because obviously I'm still trying to set the car out I can't do any work stuff so I'm just gonna run some errands I was gonna go to Zara and to Primark because I have some stuff to return and exchange actually I'm gonna go to Primark here first I don't want to go to the big Primark there's a Primark here I'm in Hammersmith so I'm just gonna do a quick return in Primark here and I'm gonna go to Zara and do a return in Zara as well hopefully by the time I come back my car should be done they said it's gonna take 40 minutes so hopefully I can be done by then. I'm so glad I have my wig on and I actually look like a decent human being because if I didn't, this would have been so bad. I nearly didn't come out with my wig. The weather today is actually quite nice. I feel like getting another coffee, but I'm just gonna get coffee shakes if I get another coffee. I'm not about to get the coffee shakes. So I'm not going to get another coffee. I'm just gonna do what I gotta do and move. Today is... Slowly turning into another eventful day. Hopefully, after I run my errands, the day will kind of quiet down a bit. I always find out that my Costco card is expired. So that's a little bit of shit. So 
I'm just gonna put my stuff shape as what I get. really quickly and there isn't really much happening at work today so i think it's going to be like a chilled work day which is good because if i was actually at work it would have been so boring today so i'm just gonna make myself a nice quick drink because i've just eaten really badly i had a hot dog from costco i had a slice of pizza and i had pepsi max and those three things i don't usually eat and this is the reason why i'm again in a better way but you know what i'm trying to just enjoy my last week of nonsense eating well i'm trying to make this my last day of nonsense eating and then from tomorrow hopefully i can go back to eating like an actual grown human being so right now look at my belly look at that she bloated this freak so right now i'm just going to make myself my drink that i always make where's my bottle but i need to wash my bottle first <laughs> I don't have my head scarf on my scarf my hair is looking kind of crazy but it is what it is my cornrows look a little bit shady they're trying to shade my ass <laughs> i forgot that i was vlogging i totally forgot i was doing some work i was doing some actual work stuff so i'm done now it's 20 past six so i'm just watching a movie i'm watching what's love got to do with it i've actually never watched love what's love got to do so i'm gonna kind of take this because I, I don't want my head show um yeah i'm watching what's love got to do with it and um, i've never watched it before and i was just looking at something on megan good's um instagram and she put a like a little thing with angela bassett and i love angela i love her like i love her so much i really like her so i was like oh yeah i've never watched what's love got to do with it so i'm watching that right now and i'm just literally i'm trying not to snack but i've already snacked on like three biscuits so right now i'm just sipping on my drink that i made earlier and i'm gonna watch what's love got to do with it sorry guys about my hair but it is what it is this is real life this is not a gimmick this is not a scam i'm just watching that and then i'm going to get ready to go out later on today so i'm gonna see you guys later mm -hmm. 